Dear Rebounding Friends, today we learn the correct body alignment. So come with me onto the rebounder. So when you're standing on your rebounder, imagine your head being a balloon which is floating up into the sky. And then on this balloon hangs this thread. The thread is your spine and it just hangs down loose. Yeah. So the head goes up like a balloon and the spine hangs on it like a thread. And then look a bit, get aware of your eyes for a moment. You know, very often we have the eyes very fixed on something, very concentrated. And when we are rebounding, what we want to do is let the eyes be soft. Yeah? Imagine your hands, see your hands when they are on the side. We want to have a peripheral view so that you see the hands there. And that's the way we want to rebound. Relax the eyes. Soften them, soften the gaze. And then breathe. Come in a soft bouncing. <sighs> breathe. And the next thing where we look at is our tailbone. And imagine on your tailbone is hanging a weight, a very heavy weight, and that is pulling down. You still have the balloon here, and the weight is pulling down there. And imagine the weight hanging on a thread, and the thread goes deep, deep into the earth, through all the different layers of the earth, into the core, into the iron core of the earth. And so there you have the alignment. On one side, the balloon up in the air, your spine hanging on it, and then the grounding cord deep into the earth. And that's the alignment where you're bouncing on. Yeah, That's the alignment where in every moment when we are rebounding, we're bouncing on this alignment. And then when you are rebounding, you know, it's the difference between trampolining and rebounding. Trampolining tries to jump out of the mat as high as you can, while in rebounding you bounce downward. So your heel goes more down into the mat, and the mat brings you up automatically. And breathe, and relax, and imagine again the balloon going up, spine, the grounding cord hanging on your tailbone going into the earth. Okay, and now it's up to you. At least bounce your base time. Bye!